Talking to a man known throughout the world as Big Mo. Yes. I wonder why that is. Yeah, <laughs> fitting nickname occasionally. <laughs> um, but Mo, you, you are um, accepted now. We've seen you on Sky, we see you everywhere. Just tell us very briefly about how you all got into this. Oh man, it's, it's, I mean, it's been an amazing journey to get here. This has become my home away from home almost, doing all the shows with Sky and Boxer and things like that. But I have a special place in my heart for Bare Knuckle, so I've made sure to have Bare Knuckle be a part of what I do yeah. still. And uh, it's been an amazing journey here. You know, this has all happened kind of quick for me because typically it's a, you know, an older demographic of people that do the job and I'm newer. And, you know, I was on Talk Sport the other day and I was talking to them about it and I got some really nice messages from the people here. And what I love about working here is I, you guys have the best fans. Like I love, I love being an American, proud American, but the fandom here is unbelievable, especially with Bare Knuckle. And uh, we're going to see it tonight. What makes you a great MC? Detail, attention to detail, um, but in my opinion, the, the big difference is you have to be able to entertain people. What I've always said is that if we expect people to pay a considerable Good amount money. of money yeah. for a ticket and spend four hours of their life, we should be able to entertain them. And the reality is, is that I have a, a role and a job that is very front-facing where I can talk to both the in-ring crowd and the crowd that watches virtually. I'm the only one that's allowed to do that. Yep. Commentators only talk to the virtual, right? So because of that, if I can add just a little bit of a flow to it, if I can add an, a little bit of substance to it, it keeps the energy high and it keeps people engaged. I was going to say, that was my next thing, is the way you engage with fans is pretty, it's pretty, it's not all do that. You yeah. engage with the fans and that's important. Absolutely. No, I think, uh, again, it's, it's, we're all in this together, whether you're a fan, whether you're a promoter, whether you're whoever. You know, we, we so often hear about who does what, but we sometimes forget about the people that actually are the consumers of the product. I agree, we don't have a show without fighters. We don't have ticket sales without a promoter. We don't have a, a broadcast without a broadcaster. But we also don't have just a show at all without people that actually want to watch it. And so being able to, to do stuff for the fans and being able to connect with them is vitally important. Is it difficult for you today, USA against the UK? Is it difficult? <sighs> well, the thing is, is now I, now I have friends on both sides. I was going to say, you're... you're Footy I mean, both camps. Yeah, I mean, I'm here. I was here last week. I was in uh, London last week. I got to announce at York Hall for the first time, and that was an amazing moment for me. Mecca of boxing in this country. York I didn't Hall. know. Didn't know there was no AC yeah. either. That was yeah. a small detail I missed. <laughs> and I'm in Manchester next week for Savannah Marshall. So the fact that I have friends here in the UK, but I'm from America, I have friends back home, I'm happy because of that because it'll keep me neutral tonight, yeah. which is an important thing as well. UK or USA, who do you think is going to take the trophy? It looks a good bill. I think, I think the U.S. is going to take the trophy, but I, with the belts tonight, I might lean a little bit more to the BKB side. Two big belts. fights. Yeah, great fights, a great rematch, a great main event. I think it's a toss-up. I wouldn't be surprised if one side takes the belts and the other side takes the cup. And that is a perfect example of sitting on the fence. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. A little bit of a political answer, but that's okay. Listen, it's perfect. Mo, thanks very much indeed. He's the big Mo. He's the main man. He's on Be In Sports at this show and CombatSports.tv. Mo, thank you. Thank you, Top guys. Man, thanks. Thank you, BKB. Thank you, BYB. I'll see you guys in the ring or in the Trigon very soon. There you go.